A teenager is now in custody and facing charges in the case of a gay man stabbed to death at a New York gas station. ABC's Phil Lipoff is here with more on those developments. Good morning, Phil. Good morning to you, Will. This morning, New York City police say a 17-year-old has been charged with murder as a hate crime after a fight at a Brooklyn gas station. This happened last Saturday night. 28-year-old professional dancer O'Shea Sibley and a friend were filling up their car after a day at the beach. Sibley dancing near the car. Witnesses say the 28-year-old, seen wearing the red shorts, was then confronted by a group yelling homophobic slurs. The surveillance video appearing to show a heated exchange between the two groups and shortly after what you're seeing, Sibley was stabbed and died at the hospital. The chair of the New York City Gay Men's Choir releasing a statement saying, quote, O'Shea was a shining light to his family and friends, especially those in the dance community. Sibley's family says he was a loving individual who just loved to dance. This tragedy putting a spotlight on violence against the LGBTQ plus community. And ABC News has learned the suspect has been charged with, as I mentioned, murder as a hate crime and criminal possession of a weapon. Janae? An unimaginable story that he was just dancing and showing his joy. Phil, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.